thing I ate in St. Martin as a pescatarian who does not like fish. We went to Mr. Chow the first night. It's like in the strip. This was the least favorite of ours. The bao buns were okay. This cauliflower annoyed me because it was like boiled. Pad Thai was actually good here. Anywho, next morning we made breakfast in the Airbnb. I love a simple egg and cheese. Look how glowy I am. Like, oh my God, let's tune in. And I had an uh, impossible burger from a lottery farm. And it was so good that the chef had to show me that it was an impossible burger. Because I couldn't believe it. It was too good. Went to this bakery. This was so good. The dessert and this cookie. Oh my god, so yummy. Then we had Indian food. The mosa was so good. The sauces. I love spice, so I was in heaven. Very tasty, very flavorful. This place I love that was definitely going back. I love Indian food. I'm here adding all the sauces. Girl, sauce me up. I am that type of girl. Cauliflower again threw me off. I like crispy cauliflower. The shrimp was really good. It had a good spice. The naan bread, amazing. I'll definitely come back here. Dessert, if you don't like rose water, don't, don't try this. Anywho, then the next morning I had a grilled cheese. I love grilled cheeses. We went to Sandbar and I ordered a shrimp burrito here. This is a burrito. It was so cheesy and flavorful. I loved it. I could have used a little more spice, but... I was not complaining. It was amazing. Then we had pizza. I mean, it's not a New York slice, but it was decent. Anywho, by the beach, we had the best. Oh, the shrimps were so amazing with plantains. Loved it. Then the last night, we went to Bamboo. Oh my God, this food was amazing. Like the noodles, the rice, tempura, that corn was so flavorful. Oh my God, I'm still thinking about this rice. The noodles, everything. 10 out of 10 on this place. Anywho, last day, we had a quick egg and cheese. And then I went home. As always, thank you for watching.